All right, guys, uh, we're here with the second episode of Pokemon Blue. Uh, I had actually lost an episode, so I'm already in the Viridian Forest, which really sucks. We're going to try and uh, grind all the Pokemon up to what's Squirtle's level. We'll match everybody at level 7, and then we'll go fight this guy, go heal, unless I happen to die beforehand. Uh, and then we'll fight Brock for the first time and see if we can beat him with all level 7s. So yeah, that really sucks that I lost the second episode, but what are you going to do? I, I like the level here because uh, I think it's easiest. You usually run into Metapod or Kakuna depending on the version you're playing. And they're usually level 5, 6, 7. And they don't do anything but harden, so they're rather easy to kill. Therefore, you get better experience than fighting 15 rat tattoos. So, let's get my Pikachu up. I just caught this Pikachu at the end of what would have been the second episode, but all of a sudden it's gone off my phone, which is odd to me. Really odd to me, actually. I gotta watch the time, but I got lots of time, so. Oh, Pikachu grew to level 4, yay! We're going to try and avoid this guy, because I haven't fought him yet, so... Let's get some more Metapods. Come on. Thank you. You ever notice when you want to get into a battle, you don't, but when you're just trying to trek through, you get into a battle every 15 seconds? Or is that just my luck? Thundershock this mother... Maximum hardness. I would laugh if that popped up one time. Don't ask. I've been rewatching the anime, and I just watched that episode, and it was hilarious. Also, I'll be opening some Pokemon evolutions. Uh, actually, the video is already recorded. It's just I don't know which I'm gonna put up first, whether it be the evolutions opening or this. So. Just keep watching. I love the set. I already have about half the set, 56 out of the 113 cards that are in it. So, if I complete the set, there will be a video on that too. Uh, I must say, I'm having a lot of fun with Evolutions. Loving it. As a 90s kid, it's bringing back so many memories. Still haven't pulled the damn Charizard. But, I pulled the Charizard EX. I don't know if that counts. But Come on, where the hell's all the damn battles? I might do a recap on all of the uh, Evolutions cards I have so far. I haven't got any doubles of rares yet, but I have like fucking seven polygons. <laughs> seven fucking Voltorbs, it's brutal. The amount of doubles of commons and uncommons I have. And I have not pulled one secret rare yet, believe that or not. Halfway down the set without a, a secret rare. I know they're in the uncommon spot, so you'd think they'd be easy to pull, but they're actually not. I've probably opened about 15 packs and have not got one yet. Hey, another 61 experience. I'll take it. Doo -doo, doo -doo. That really sucks that the whole forest got cut off. Damn it. I also have Pokemon Silver that I might do a playthrough of after, and then Pokemon Pearl. But I might go in order from like, do one of Gen 1, Gen 2, Gen 3, Gen 4. I might do that. But I just have Pearl because I don't have any on the DS, and I wanted to play something newer. Do I have a Caterpie? Let me check my Pokemon. Yes, I do. Yay, level 6 Pikachu. Pretty sure my Caterpie is actually ready to evolve when it's his turn to come out. Probably put him out next. Pikachu needs one more level.
All right, let's just go battle this guy. I hate it when it takes forever to run into battles. Oh no, he sent out Weedle. Oh shit, it's level 9 actually. Nice. Maybe I'm not going to be able to beat Brock with all level 7s. We'll find out. <laughs> I know Pikachu is going to be useless in that battle. Pikachu! Who else needs to go up? I don't know, Mike. Caterpie. I know if I can get Caterpie into Butterfree and get a, I think it's Confusion or Poison, he does a lot of, he does a lot of damage to, uh, to the rock Pokemon, and, uh, Rattata with Quick Attacks is good. My Squirtle will fucking, I'll tank him, and then I have Pikachu for when I get the Misty. Wow, I'm getting killed here. Can Rattata do it? Just so I can go by and heal my guys. Uh, I tried to catch a Nidoran. Couldn't get the fucker though, no matter how much I tried. Just wouldn't run into him, it was pissing me off actually. Oh, I only had one, thankfully. <laughs> Damn. All right, let's go up, 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 into town. We'll be coming back to the forest. I just got to heal. And yes, I know my sound effects logo is uh, over the buttons, but uh, I didn't realize that I can't move it after I place it. And uh, I had my phone upright, not sideways, so it was in a totally different spot. I thought, oh, the, that'll be perfect, but it, it wasn't. Here. I think I can run into Diglett here. Maybe not. Well, whatever. Just grind a couple of levels, then take on the gym. If we get smashed, we get smashed, which I'm pretty sure I'm gonna get smashed, but it's worth a look. Get everybody to level 7 and see if I can do it at a low level. Oh, level 2 Rattata. That's uh, going to give me lots of experience. Pidgey. Do I not have a Pidgey? I'm pretty fucking sure I have a Pidgey. But I'm pretty sure he's really weak. Oh, level 4. He's not half bad. Whoops. <laughs> One hit. Nice, Pikachu. He's got to be close to level 7. That's what I really liked about Gold and Silver, was it had the experience bar underneath. You didn't actually have to go in and check the stats every 15 seconds. But, what are you going to do? Wow, he missed. Yay, Pikachu did it. He's the weakest. So, let's power him up. Because Gust can hurt the rock Pokemon. 
if he's strong enough. Oh, level two. Fuck. This is what I mean. That's why I like Viridian Forest, I think it is. Or whatever forest I was just in. I'm pretty sure it's Viridian Forest. Because uh, the, the Metapods are always levels five, six, seven. It's the highest I've seen was seven. And they're easy to kill. So let's go back. Even if they run into a Caterpie, they're still relatively easy to kill. And usually a decent level, 4 or 5. Metapod. Wow, what's with me missing all these attacks? Now I'm hitting like next to nothing. Oh, shiza, shiza, shiza. Actually, I think Pikachu can still uh, paralyze the rock Pokemon. He just doesn't do a lot of damage to them. Which I'm fine with even paralyzing them, but... Yay, Pidgey leveled up and learned Sand Attack. He looks angry. Look at them eyes. <laughs> Look at them eyebrows, actually. That was funny. Got lots of time. Yay. Get Pidgey up one more, then change to Caterpie, then Rattata, then go take on the uh, gym. I mean, we're probably going to get killed uh, on Brock, but that's that's totally fine. The point is to see if I can do it at this level. I don't know. I, I, I thought it'd be interesting for viewers. Uh, switch out to Caterpie, which I believe is going to evolve when he hits level 7, because I know he's Butterfree by 10 or 11, so... The Battle of the Caterpies. Also, um, by the time this goes up, uh, I'll have a mythical box battle. I open Arceus, uh, or Arceus, however you want to say it. My wife opens Victini. Um, probably by, like, mid-November, we'll probably have Keldeo and Genesect. And then we'll probably just do, like, a shared opening of, uh, the final mythical box. And then I've got all of them, which I'm happy about. All the pins and promos. They look, I'll eventually show my pin board, but I know I've been saying that forever, but I haven't really got any new Pokemon pins except for the RCS and Victini. Got a couple new superhero pins on there, but 
I originally wanted it just for Pokemon pins, but we'll see. If I end up getting some more, if they come out with a really another really cool Pokemon pin that I like, then I'll get it. If not, then I won't. Come on, Caterpie. What the hell are you at? 32 to level 7. Shizer. He's probably going to die before he gets his level. Maybe not. It just takes so long to kill a Metapod. Because <laughs> he only has Tackle, which doesn't really do much demo. Uh, demo. Damage to begin with. Ow, oh, motherfucker. My cat just bit me. Sparkle, stop it. You're a good kitty. Yes, you are. You're a good kitty. You're a good little kid, kid, kitty. Harden. Tackle. Nice. Harden. Tackle. Shizer. Yay, level 7. What? Caterpie is evolving. Told you. <laughs> That's my uh, take on it. Alright. Pokemon. Switch. And we might get Squirtle to level 8 just because he's the leader of my team. So we might level him once. I think Red Tattle will have an easier time out here, to be honest. Oh no, a wild Pidgey appeared. Finish him. Damn it. How close is he? So maybe I could switch him out mid battle. Seventy four, no. Shiza. Want him to only quick attack just so the rock guys go down easier, but you can't win them all, so do I have a potion? Yes, I do. Whoop. Damn it. Wow, he missed. He's probably going to die here. I don't like to switch my guys out until they die. Come on, live it. Nope. Wow, Squirtle doesn't even know Bubble yet, so we would definitely level him up. Until he learns it, which I believe is level 8, but I might be wrong. It might be 10, to be honest with you. Yeah. Squirtle learned bubble, I was right. Alright. Let's go heal and take on the gym. And then that'll be it. Can we get a victory? We will find out in a moment's time. 
Then the next episode will probably be some grinding and definitely some Pokemon hunting. Most definitely. Because I only have five. And, well, my Pokedex will say otherwise because Caterpie evolved. But, I only have five Pokemon. up that way. Sorry, it's been a while, guys. We'll keep the two weakest up top, which would probably be these two. I'll go in that order. Squirtle can deal some heavy damage himself. Yes, I know I could have avoided him, but it's worth the experience. I like to usually just kill one of his guys, and then die, and then come back and kill that same guy over and over, because you get good experience from the gym leaders. See what Pikachu can do to a Diglett. Well. It doesn't affect Diglett. Well, uh, Pikachu's useless in this battle. And he's dead. Alright, we're gonna cheat some levels now. Pokemon. Switch to Squirtle. My turn. What? You bastard, you stole a turn. Probably should have saved that potion. Critical, come on. Nope. Unless he misses. Nope, didn't think so. That's okay. I wasn't expecting to beat this gym, to be honest. But, stealing a couple of experience isn't half bad. There we go, Pidgey grew to level 8. That was the point of it. Trainer, trainer is about to use Sand True. We'll slick change Pokemon. To Metapod. I love how it literally looks like a mouse in this game. Uh, we'll pop out Rattata now, see if Rattata can do better. much damage as I can. He's dead. Actually, I'm trying to level Metapod, so... I lost. This was to be expected, though, guys. I just wanted to go in and fucking steal a level or two, but... It's alright. We'll try one more time after this, except this time... I'll switch to Squirtle, like, right in the beginning and just tank him. At least tank the Diglett with him. Slick is out of usable Pokemon. Slick blacked out. I don't understand that. Why didn't they just say he ran away? Like, <laughs> that's what really happened. Couldn't fight no more. He lost. He's gotta go to a Pokemon Center. Get over it. Gotta check on the time. We're all right, I think. You're still light years from facing Brock. 
yet that's that's distance, not time. So uh, yeah, dig with dig, dig with dig, trio, trio, trio. I got Pikachu, Shiza. a good kitty sparkles yes you are you're such a good kitty can I beat him with squirtle maybe critical come on damn it Damn it. I definitely got a level Squirtle because he's dying in like three hits, which is bad, but. Oh, nice. Metapod did it. I wasn't expecting that. Nice. Metapod grew to level eight. Fight until you can't fight no more. I'm going to drink till I can't think no more. Smoke till I can't see no more. i seen that on YouTube. It was uh, an alright rap song. Fight till you can't fight no more. Okay, I'm pretty sure Pikachu can hurt him because he's not made of rock. Nope, that's fucking stupid. Just kill me already. Sparkles, get your claw out of me, buddy. That fucking hurts. The sand attack shit is so annoying, man. Just fucking kill me, Christ. Thank you. Thank you, finally, you useless damn bird. Come here, cat. I killed him, but, uh, you know, Pidgey likes to be useless for me. Always has been, though. Until he becomes, like, Pidgeotto. Then he, th about that time, he's, he's alright. If I hold on to him. Alright guys, well, turns out I can't do it at my current level. So, you're just going to have to wait for uh, episode 3. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. And, uh, see ya!